Topping our news this evening, Circus Sarasota bringing joy and wonder to a packed house despite a very tough week. On Wednesday, a practice performance of a daring eight-person pyramid high-wire stunt that would have broken a world record went horribly wrong. Five performers fell to the ground from 28 feet up. Two are still in the hospital, but doctors expect them to make full recoveries. And the show must go on, especially in honor of those performers. ABC 7's Rick Adams was there for opening night and has more from Under the Big Top. Well, there is always a lot of excitement surrounding opening night of a circus. What makes this extra special is what Circus Sarasota here has had to endure the last couple of days. It's family fun for everyone, from the talented performers to the hilarious clowns and eye-catching animal acts. The talent is unbelievable, and, and it's just a, a very happy and positive and just amazing place to be. Just love the fun, always in for a good time. Audience members who are always in for a good time are the kids, from young children to the teens. I'm really excited to see the circus because I'm just so excited to see all the people and what they do. I like the flipping, all the tumbling and everything. World-renowned circus performers, the Flying Walendas, featuring Nick Walenda and other talented high-wire performers, are focused now more than ever. They are part of the grand finale on the high-wire just days after other members of their team went plunging to the ground from at least 28 feet in the air. Wednesday's accident is still on the minds of circus goers. I think as long as it's a careful show and everybody's cautious and still there to entertain, that's what the circus is all about. ABC 7 morning anchor Jacqueline Matter even got in on all the circus excitement. She served as an honorary ringmaster for this opening night. I haven't been to the circus since I was a little girl, so I'm actually looking forward to taking part in this and watching the fans kind of be amused by all of this and to be a part of such a monumental night. Circus Sarasota runs through March 5th here on the grounds next to the mall at UTC and there are still tickets available for all of their shows. Reporting from Sarasota, I'm Rick Adams, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.